Hey, what's happening, buddy? You good? All right. Hey, everybody. Happy day. Happy day. I just wanted to come on here and, and enlighten you all a little bit and tell you that it's a beautiful day. Um, hang in there. Remain strong. Remember what our president said, January 6th, in front of the fakeness. He said, go home. Remain peaceful. Go home. In other words, he was saying, go home. Relax. My father's got this. Trust me. That's all he was saying. These people are not going to take our country, all right? They've had it for too long. We're taking it back. All right, just like my song says, what's right, that's what's right. And it's going to happen, people. I've been telling you for six months or so. But that's okay. You're going to see it soon. Like, uh, Maybe tomorrow, maybe tonight, maybe in two days. But you're going to see the reality of life. The good life. Not the Democrat life. Not where they're wanting to take us. It's disgusting where they want to take us. It's been disgusting where they want to take us. And you know what's so sad? is they're threatening us. Now on national TV, oh, anybody that voted for Trump needs to be reprogrammed and locked up and taken to camps. Let me tell you something, people. There was black, Hispanic, Chinese, Japanese, all different kinds of races, including the old negative white man, right? Isn't that what they say? White supremacists or whatever? They all voted for Trump. So we need to all be locked up. Plus they say, we're coming after you. You know what? That's a threat if you ask me. It gives them no right to be like this. We didn't do nothing wrong to them. Everything for the last three years before the last year was fine. It was the best economy, the best life ever. And they knew it. They knew it. And they knew their time was soon to come to an end. So they had to reach inside that bag of tricks for the last time. And spent the last year digging hard, baby. And they're still digging. And man, I'll tell you what. They are fooling so many people. Fooling so many people. But remember now. Their father is the master of lies. The master of deception. The master of all evil. But guess what? My father is back in a freaking bone. And he's going to crush his head. You watch. I tell you what, you're not going to be able to probably watch the fight on TV. But just go get some marshmallows tonight. Hopefully it ain't too late. You might even be able to get some of that Jiffy Pop. Have a nice little bonfire, whatever. Enjoy your time with your kids, your family. Sit back. Let the uh, the National Guard, the soldiers, the Marines, everybody, just let them do their job. You stay home like the president said to. Don't go out there and do anything stupid, okay? Because if you do, you might get caught up in the draft. 
And I don't mean going to fight. I mean, good night. So just stay home and, and just wait until it's over. Because there's a storm coming. Batten down the hatch and get ready. Get ready to walk out your door. And remember to look up in the sky and see how beautiful it finally looks. The sky will be bluer. The screen, the trees will be greener. But people, remember. Remember who we are and who we always have been. One nation under God. Until we see each other again. Have a good night. Love you now. So does God. And so does your president, Donald J. Trump.